Twitter X is just such a cesspool now, right? Shit show. It's a shithole, right? You yeah. can't you can't win no matter what. Everything like less and less and less less time. Elon fucked that shit up, right? Badly. He, he fucked that shit up. But you know, Instagram still chill, TikTok still chill, and there's other places, right, that aren't so bad where you can mess with people and have fun. Um, but you just can't do it on on Twitter. That this X conversation is is important because. You know, as the conversation around like real radical free speech continues to like carry on here, I mean, that's kind of what you have there. And and more so, he probably Elon would probably say this isn't the case, but it seems to me that algorithmically the bad stuff is elevated. Oh, I'll I, tell you I, exactly I why. I read it. that shit, right? I'm a tech guy. Yeah. Right. So maybe they changed it, but I'm like, okay, you know, because I was giving Elon some shit about it. So right? yeah. And so I mean, let me just look at, because they, they open source their algorithms to their credit. And the way it works, is called a um, nearest tree or something like that um, algorithm, where if you are a big user on X, Twitter, then every, and you have a lot of followers and those followers engage with you, then all the shit, not only, not only your shit gets elevated, but all the people you engage with get elevated. So when Elon interacts with some of these crazy followers, fucked up people their shit gets elevated and the people that they talk to their shit gets elevated that's that tree thing right that, that so, i've noticed it i've yeah. noticed it when i when i because sometimes your I'm, for you page turns into a shit it's show. a disaster and i'm not going to claim innocence i've certainly have watched some of these school fights or Fuck or yeah. played into some of these conspiracy theories when i read them because like you and i've seen it from you the frustration that exists inside of me for the past 10 years watching this continue to just yes. snowball yes. is is massive. And I know that it has been with you. And it's tough. Like it's like five, you know, three years ago on Twitter, right? You could engage with somebody and it could be real, right? And there there can be an in-depth conversation where people are like, okay, you know, I'm learning something. Mm -hmm. I'm giving something and I'm getting something. That's a win-win. Now, oh my God, you say anything and it's just like, whoosh, yeah, yeah. fucking trolls come out at night, right? And it's awful. What's the solution? Um, Elon has got to take himself out of the algorithm. And I posted that to him. Mm -hmm. You think right? he's that, he, he as a player is that powerful, him personally? He has 160 million users and mm -hmm. the, the, the algorithm is designed to amplify your biggest users and the people that they engage with. So if he just says, okay, extract myself from the algorithm, then, you know, when he says excellent or interesting or whatever the shit he posts, right? Because he, he knows that that shit's just, it backdoors everything that happens on Twitter. And he can claim non-involvement yeah, because he's just writing, this is an interesting stat, right. but just by doing that, doing it's that, promoted. It, boom, it, yeah. it's promoted mm, so everywhere. Wild. And then the people that promote with that post, that promote with that, all that shit just, it just amplifies and gets amplified. And so if he just said, you know, because he still has 160 million followers. So if he posts, 160 million pe people have a chance to see it, but you just don't want that shit influencing what gets seen by everybody else. What about a, a forced uh, identification system where people- That would kill his business. He can't. Yeah. Really? I thought, yeah. I, I thought I saw something that people- No, he went to, to charge a dollar, yeah, to make sure that- Per year. Not bots. No, that's bullshit, right? Be, be, I, I think if, if people have to actually be people- and the human that is behind the tweet is revealed because they have to I submit their you. ID. I agree with you. I agree with you because then they can't, be, you, you know. You can't be anonymous you can't, you, and yeah, trolling. Yeah, you can't be a pussy and just sit there and, and talk shit, yeah. you know, because people know who you are, mm -hmm. right? Um, I agree that that would help, but it would kill his business. But there also yeah. is a, 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 there's a fucked up point here in that there was a verification system that yeah, every that he, social yeah. that he then that abandoned. wasn't perfect, but, but it worked. It, it yeah. wasn't perfect, but it worked because at least when you saw that blue check, you had some... Semblance. Especially if it was the name you knew, right? Exactly. Right. Because this is Logan. This is Mike. Exactly. Right. I know that they're real. Right? right. And now anybody can buy one, and 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 it's you know, and you can then claim. To and be it's a eight bucks, individual. you know. So if you just want to fuck with people for a month, right? You pay your eight bucks, and then what happens is it moves you right to the top. So when you go look down in someone's mentions, you see all these people that paid the eight dollars. That, you know, I'm, I'm gonna tell you something else, and I can't prove this, but I think that he's doing. Um, I think he's taking. Um, old abandoned accounts that, you know, accounts someone opened in 2015 and hasn't used since 2015 and turned them into bots to amplify the number of users. The on thing the that he said he was fighting against. Right. Basically. Well, yeah, because, but he controls them, right? So they're his bots. They're his bots. Elon has an army, army of bots. bots. I'm guessing, right? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'm guessing. I love this. But when I, when I went to um, 
the World Economic Forum. That's what we were talking about. <laughs> oh, you about. went there? Oh, oh, yeah. You know what oh, I did? You're, <laughs> you're a bad dude, bro. You're a bad Damn. dude. Oh, Billionaire my wars. God. And qu- qu- here's another question. Do you think that now, especially that that uh, X has become monetized, and, and you actually, I'll, I'll be honest, you actually can make it. I made decent, two grand one month, yeah, because something yeah. took off, yeah. You, you can know? make a, and for like the average person who doesn't real money, have yeah, that yeah, level yeah. of wealth, that's yeah, a that's lot of money, money, right? Um, do you think this elevation of of hatred and just kind of nasty rhetoric that we're seeing is less representative of Elon's algorithm and more representative of like a systemic issue that we as people have? No. You no, don't I don't so. think Twitter's real world. Oh, if certainly it's yeah, not. Yeah, it's not. No, I think, you know, when you get on Twitter, it, it's like there's all kinds of gyms you can go work out at. If you get go to an MMA gym, you're getting into one type of workout, right? And yeah. you're going to expect someone's going to hit somebody, someone's going to get hit, right? You go to jiu-jitsu, different type of work. You go to a regular gym, play ball, different type of workout. You know what you get when you go to Twitter. Great analogy. Right? Yep. And, you know... And now you see what Threads is doing to try to compete. It's not there yet, but there's better engagement on Threads. There's just not as wa- as much wide of breadth of of expertise, right? On Twitter, you can find somebody who knows something about everything, mm. right? And still, and on Threads and on the others, you can't. Who I, wins, Elon or Zuck, in that box? In that fight? Zuck kicks his ass. You know that. I mean, pr- you know, if you know, um, if, if you have the skills, right, in within that. Um, whatever, what's he do? Jiu Jitsu? Yeah, 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 yeah. But he also stri- does striking, I think. Yeah, Jiu-jitsu so I for mean, a while. but you know, if, if you know the actual sport and you've been trained in the sport, yeah. you're going to take on somebody who's not been trained, no matter what the size difference is. Hey guys, if you like that clip, hit the subscribe button. And if you want to see more zany clips, click the video right here. <laughs>